Is Steven Spielberg the next Bill Cosby? I think so. I'm wagering that he is. I think something's going to happen really soon. Uh, okay, so somebody in the industry that I used to know said that there, Steven Spielberg and Jeffrey Kat, Katzenberg and the other one, they're known as the three M egos. Amigos, but egos. Because their egos are so fucking out of control. So the news broke that uh, Steven Spielberg's adopted daughter wants to be a porn star or whatever the hell. She wants to be naked in front of the whole world, right? And then she also said that she's sick of feeling like she has to restrain her uh, sexuality or some shit. Uh, There's a lot of implicit, (laughs) a lot of implied shit there. So you got to wonder. Okay, and then my friend wrote to me and he goes, uh, hmm. He goes, well, he basically says, Steven Spielberg is a pedophile. Just wait, you'll see. And I'm like, actually, that makes a lot of sense. Because, isn't it weird? (laughs) Like, it's really weird that he likes to make movies with children all the time. Like, that's really, and I'm like, he's like a child who never grew up. And then, and also, like, so he doesn't have, like, a dick. Because he, he has to adopt children, so he can't actually impregnate a woman. And my friend mentioned how he got he got he, he got fired or whatever from the Indiana Jones, the new Indiana Jones movie. It seems like there's something going on here. And um I think it was Robert McKee who said like Steven Spielberg's movies are so empty. They're so devoid of any kind of meaning. They're just like popcorn. He just does popcorn bullshit. Like he's never done anything like with any kind of passion, and then uh, and then he also uh, he also enabled Michael Bay to destroy the Transformers, which is one of the closest things in my heart. Thank you, Steven Spielberg. You stupid. You stupid. I don't trust anybody who pretends they don't have a dick. Who doesn't? Who pretends that they're not like uh, a pervert? Because we're all perverts. So, but who is this guy? All of a sudden, he just, he's just above it all. Like, he's just like a squeaky, squeaky, I don't trust squeaky clean images any more than I trust Bill Cosby, man. Squeaky clean image, right? Yeah, so my friend just said, like, he's the next one that's going to be out and all sorts of shit's going to come out about him. I wouldn't be surprised at all. Uh... He seems, yeah, it is a weird, bit weird that he like makes movies about uh, children, children all the time, and he also directed a Michael Jackson video. So like him and Michael Jackson, they're like, you know. <laughs> uh, personally, I just wanted to fail because of what he did, allowing Michael Bay to destroy Transformers, which is my favorite thing in the world. But isn't it kind of weird that he adopts children instead of having his own? Like, I, I think that's really strange. I mean, uh, I watched a Steven Spielberg documentary where it's like he's just like this nerd that was lucky enough to get into the uh, the forefront of Hollywood. But otherwise, he's like a, he's a socially inept loser, right? Like, he had no abilities socially. Um, is he a closet pedophile is my question. I guess we're going to find out really soon. And I take no enjoyment out of making this video. Like, it's actually, I find it very depressing. But just for the record, I I think this is what's going to happen. If you like gays, click like. If you like blacks, comment. If you like women, click notification bell. If you like gay women, subscribe. And if you like gay black women, uh, Patreon Human Warnings.